when's the right time to start my handmade business? Hi, I'm Jess Van Den. Welcome to another Create and Thrive Q&A. Well, the answer is really quite simple. Right now. There's never going to be the perfect time to start your business. If you're already making something and you've already started thinking about selling it, or you are already selling it, you've got a business. It's all in the mind. Now, yeah, there's going to be legalities and there's going to be, depending on where you live, there are going to be particular maybe tax obligations or things that you might have. And that's something you have to investigate and sort out. But really, when you make that transition in your mind from I'm a hobbyist to I have a business, that's when you're in business. So whenever you really have made the decision that you want to turn that hobby of yours into a business, that's the point where you start taking things seriously, start keeping track of your income and expenses, create a website, have a Facebook page and maybe an Instagram account and start really diving deep and researching on how to make a successful business happen. But just be prepared. It's a lot harder than you might think. And it's going to take a lot of time and you're going to have to be very patient to grow a successful handmade business. But that doesn't mean it can't happen because it can and does. I have one and I know hundreds or thousands of other people who have successful handmade businesses, whether part-time or full-time. So it really comes down to you being dedicated and being ready to put in the work to learn how to run a business instead of just having a hobby. If you want to learn more about running a thriving, profitable handmade business, head on over to my website, createandthrive.com, where you can listen to my weekly podcast tour makers, read a whole bunch of blog posts. Also, I've got e-courses, e-books, and my membership community, The Thriver Circle, full of hundreds of makers just like you who are doing exactly that. <music>